Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Kat here. I've been wanting to film more YouTube videos, but you know, the thought of like, you know, getting all dressed up, doing my makeup, and then sitting down and having a, a nice spot with good lighting and a good background, like all of that is just like so much. It's like such a big hurdle. And so I'm just in my car in a parking lot. I'm about to do some errands, but this, but there's still light outside. So I thought I would just film this. Like I've been wanting to do more YouTube videos um, about lessons that I've learned and today's lesson that I want to share with you is the idea of really becoming an expert on your own story. I just find like whether you're in the corporate world or trying to work for um, a company or if you're your own business, I think that you really have to become an expert at telling your own story. And the reason I say this is because, well, at least in business, you're meeting people, people are like, what do you do? Oh, how did you get into that? All of it is when people try to get to know you, they're trying to get to know your story. And so, you know, I was terrible at like, explaining my story or you know I would make it really long and rambly but then like over time you start to understand like what are the parts of my story that really resonate with people and so you learn to pick out those parts and you learn how to tie the whole thing together because like for example going into fashion like I can like explain my reason for going to fashion in like five a, a bunch of different ways um, but really the one that but I've really cut it down to like two or three ways to tell it depending on the situation that really resonates with people. Um, because people, you want to, like you want to kind of tie the events of your story in together in a way that makes sense and also reflects who you are and what you want. Because, you know, people might ask like, oh, what are your plans for the future? What do you want? And so that is part of also knowing your story and what you want and so being able to explain all that in a really concise way is really powerful because then people can understand like who you are and have a mental picture of you and then like if they introduce you to other people or whatever or if they think about you later they'll be like oh that was a person that does fashion or you know that was the person that went from being an engineer to becoming a personal stylist or whatever it is it literally has to be very short and to the point and so that's why I feel like you know, to become an expert at your own story, you have to keep practicing it and saying it over and over again to many different people. You try saying it this way and that way, and then you just experiment with it. But I just feel like um, this skill just be becomes so useful, um, whether it's in written form, like introducing yourself that way, or it's speaking it, or um, saying it in a big group like there's these are all the different ways that you need to be able to know your story be able to present yourself so um, yeah you can just practice in front of a mirror if you have no one no one that really asks if if your life situation doesn't really call for it right now just practice in front of the mirror practice out loud like just finding the words will help you the next time that someone actually does ask you so that is my um, two cents for the day. Um, and I hope you enjoy this video. Bye.